Hey, Uncle Mark here in the mothership. And uh, so it's Dickie Betts' birthday. And there was no greater influence on me uh, as a young guitar player learning how to solo uh, after I played rhythm and rhythm and rhythm for 20 years and learning how to solo. Mr. Dickie Betts was absolutely crucial in my understanding of how to play. The, uh, the way he played using those simple notes in that simple, that do, re, mi phrase and a couple other tricks. Um, all of his solos are happy. They're beautiful. They are... he does. Just beautiful little phrasing. Um, the classic is the, uh, so, uh, Classic, classic phrasing. If you're a young guitar player or an old guitar player whose rhythm skills are solid, this is where I would start focusing on um, picking out by ear um, Dickie Betts solos. Um, oh, here's another one that's really fantastic. <laughs> involved and I know I've been teasing you with all of these things and we will get to them lesson wise but uh, listen to some more Dickie Betts it is his birthday um, there's a live album that's just fantastic it's uh, wipe the windows dollar gas something like that and uh, I first saw Dickie Betts in uh, 1978 at Meriwether Post Pavilion in Columbia Maryland and uh, I was just blown away with all the little <laughs> fun little tricks so uh, definitely listen to more Dicky Betts and uh, happy birthday blue sky has got some great soloing in it same with um, Ramblin man Melissa there are just so many songs that are just personally his and uh, all of the soloing is happy there's no phrasing that is sad. It's uplifting music, and we have Dickie Betts to thank for that, and I personally have Dickie Betts to thank for that. And uh, So thank you with enjoying with me, and uh, listen to more Dickie Betts. We'll see you another time.